Hey guys, today I'm going to make a video on what's in my makeup bag. I decided to do what's in my makeup bag because I thought it would be more interesting than a regular what's in my bag. So, I'm going to jump right into that. This is my makeup bag. I have a bunch of makeup bags because I'm always doing my friends and then my friends' friends and family's friends' makeup for special occasions and prom and dances and stuff like that for school so this is just my everyday bag that I use almost every day bring it with me all the time um so yeah it's pretty big it's pretty heavy it has a lot of my stuff in it that I need to take with me if I have like a makeup emergency which I tend to have a lot so when you open it stuff might fall out it's pretty big for its size, it holds a lot of stuff. I mean, it doesn't look that big. It fits in my bag only because my bag is ginormous. But this is everything that's in it. So I'm just going to go through it randomly. So um, this is my One Base Cargo Concealer. I have been using this forever. I don't use this when I get ready in the mornings. This is just my to-go concealer. And it works really well for me. Um... For emergencies so it's lasted me a long time and it works really well I think it's in light because I always get my concealers light because then I just cover it up with a powder so this is what it's really faded because I've had it forever so this is what it looks like and then this is my I actually just got this I have tried it out I don't know why I didn't take it out of the box but this is the Vix, the Vix, this is the Victoria's Secret Bellissima or Bellissima and these are all the colors that are in it. I love the colors. Turquoise is my favorite color. Turquoise and teal and all that. So it's in here. So this is what it looks like. And then when you open it, this is all the colors. It tells you like what to use it for. I mix it up because I kind of like to try different things. I use this sometimes as a like a for under my eyes, like a liner, just to give a pop of color. But this is really good. This was on sale. It's normally 20 bucks, but at Victoria's Secret when they were having a sale here, I um I went and picked it up. So that's another thing I have. I have a lot. So I'm gonna pull out my lip glosses all at once, actually, just so that I can try and make this a little bit faster. Because I tend to talk a lot. So I think this is most of my lip glosses, or hopefully all of them. So I don't have that many in here, but I'm a lip gloss girl. I wear lipsticks occasionally. I have a lot of lipsticks, but I may I love lip glosses because I like the more wet moisturizing feeling on my lips. So um this is one this is Ice Slicks by Freeze 24-7. Um their brand makes a lot of really good things for like age defying. This is actually a lip plumper. I really like those even though my lips I don't need to necessarily make them bigger, but I just like I kind of like the tingly feeling, so this works really well, and it gives a really cute, um, nice pink shimmer. Um, this is also a lip plumper. A lot of you probably heard of this. This is my absolute favorite. Of course, my label has worn off, but this is Buxom in Blessed. Blessed, I can barely read it because it's so worn out, but this is the color, and it is it goes on really nice it gives me that tingly feeling that i love and yeah so that's good and then this has become one of my new favorites just because i am obsessed with my teeth i have to have white teeth constantly and um i have like so many different like i have floss in my purse i have like everything but anyway so this lip gloss right here is by l'oreal and this is supposed to make your teeth wider or appear wider I guess so and this actually is really pretty it doesn't come out this purple it kind of goes on with like a it's called the mystics shine in 481 oh you guys can't see because it's okay but um it goes on with like a purple tint but it fades away but I don't know how to explain it it's just a really pretty color when you put it on so I wear this a lot I've gone through a few um glosses by this and they have different colors too so that's just that one. And then my last lip gloss, actually I'm wearing this right now. This is kind of my go-to. I just, um, today I was just running on errands. That's why my hair is like a mess. I just have like this clip and then my 
I don't put heat on my hair, but so this is just like my natural messy gross hair. So anyway, so I was just kind of running around. So this is my go-to and this is um, Wet Slicks. And this is in the color Tutu. So I really like it. It's just, I think it's Wet and Wild, I think is the actual brand, but it, I don't know, it's just like a basic kind of pink lip gloss. I really like it. So that I just got for really cheap at CVS. And then the next thing is, if you don't already know, I, oh, you don't know actually. So I was making a makeup video or a tutorial with all my pop palettes, so, but I haven't published it yet, so you guys don't know. But I am obsessed with pop and um, all their eyeshadows. This is pop eye topper. This is their, a smaller palette. So... These are all the colors in this one. It's really good for summer and um, spring. So I've just been carrying this around with me. I use this a lot on a daily basis. So I just keep that in there for touch-ups. And then my brushes that I bring. These are just like the Kirkland set. Sometimes I grab these. Um, I actually just keep these in here to go because I have a lot of other brushes. These are just my to-go because they work fine. and It's just for emergencies. And um, this one is an angled eye brush which I, I barely ever use, but like I said, for emergencies. And this is just the um, blender brush, or it says it's for your crease, but it's fluffy, so I think it's more of a blender brush. So that's what that is. For my powder, this is the powder I'm using at the moment, and this is just the Physician's Formula. I've used like every powder you could think of, but this is the one that I've been using for now, and it works fine. It doesn't make me break out, so... Yeah, and this is in the color beige, and it's talc-free. I don't know, it's supposed to be pretty good for your skin, so I'm all about that. So, this is what I'm using, and I don't have a brush to apply this with, because um, I usually don't need to touch up my foundation, so. But if I do, I have this little thing that it comes with. And then, <clears throat> I have two mascaras in here. This one I haven't opened yet. My mom just brought it to me, because it's in my, one of my favorite colors. It's in Totally Teal. It looks kind of more turquoise to me, but then again, I could just have my colors mixed up. But, um, yeah, I love Great Lash, and so for, I think this would be a fun color with my contacts or something. So, yeah, and then this is my go-to mascara. This is just Scandalize by Rimmel. And yeah, it has a really big brush, really fat, so it gives me lots of, um chunkiness on my eyelashes which sometimes I don't like but if I want my eyelashes to be really bold and black then that's what I go to so these are this is also by Physicians Formula I'm actually I kind of I guess I always have Physicians Formula so I guess I could say I really like it um <clears throat> these are just like the little um it's kind of like this this is the hot pot for pop it's the eyeliner pot eyeliner I guess uh, gel eyeliner that's what it's called <clears throat> and so um this is by pot so I guess I could talk about that one real quick so that's what that is I use that all the time and these are also pot eyeliners gel eyeliners they're not by pop though and so they have different colors this is kind of a lavender color on the top can't put this on Okay, so yeah, this is a lavender color at the top. In the middle is more of a gold color, kind of a yellow gold. It's really pretty, if you can see that. And then on the bottom, it is just black, so these work pretty well. I don't think they, they don't last that long, that long for me. Um, my eyes tend to water a lot, so that's probably why, but yeah, so that's just for fun on the go. Here's another one of my brushes. This is just a Kat Von D smudging brush. I usually use this to highlight under my eyebrows. This is just in there for emergencies. Um, another physician's formula is this one. This is in nude. It's kind of just like the Naked Palette Basics. It has, and it has a lot of the colors in the Naked Palette, so I guess it's kind of a knockoff of it. So it's really shimmery though, but I love it. It's I broke it, but it still somehow stays together. But yeah, so I don't like the brushes that they come with at all. They're like really cheap and they're just, they don't work. But um, yeah, so 
Christina, hold on a second. Christina, could you take her out, please? Mm -hmm. She's like starting to fart. My dog's in here, <laughs> and she's like farting. And my sister's she back there. She's like, no, Christina, just put her out there, please. Um, okay, she's like really stinking up the joint. Holy oh. gosh. Oh no, take like take her outside. Um, I don't want her to go to the bathroom inside our house. We'll get in trouble. So this is the eye spackle, and this is just my everyday um, primer. So if I was like on the go, didn't get to have time to do my makeup, get to have time. If I didn't have time to do my makeup, I could do it with this. So also my tutorial, you should see that. That should be up soon. Um, I just need to do some editing because I talked a lot as always. So this here is my Laura Geller. Uh, in Bianco. I don't know, this is kind of like a really pretty shimmery color. Um, also just for a to-go where I can highlight under my eyebrows. And the last two things that I have, these are my blue contacts. I wear these every once in a while. I may have worn these in a video already. I can't remember. But, um, yep, these are the color blends contacts. I got these from my eye doctor. And then... These are, these are by Bloom. I rarely use these, but they're kind of fun. So again, for emergencies, I think you guys get the point. For emergencies, this is what this is. But um, this is in, they're both Stardust. I guess they're kind of like roll-on shimmer shadows. You can't see because this camp sucks, but they're, um, there's just little roll on things, so if I didn't have eyeshadow, which I obviously do, but if I didn't have it and these were just in here, I guess these would be good for me to just roll onto my eyes. So that's what these are. I don't even know where I got these or how much they were, but yeah. So that's all for my video today. I hope you guys enjoyed. Actually, hold up. Sorry. Um, Something that I carry in my bag, not my makeup bag, because I don't want it to like explode because it's full of stuff, is my Mario Badescu facial spray with aloe herbs and rose water it smells like roses it's amazing you get this at Ulta I believe um or online Mario Badescu rocks I freaking love him so yeah but this stuff works really really well too I carry that with me every day but now finally in in finally um my uh video is over so thanks for watching please subscribe and I hope you guys have a great day evening morning whatever time it is wherever you are and yes yeah, so bye